Hi guys, in this video, we're going to see how you can set up a video analysis workflow using N8. I can just upload a video and get a document of the exact contents of the video without watching the video manually. And the best part, the AI is also able to see and recognize the visuals in the video and not just the audio. I'll show you how to access the workflow and set it up step by step. To do that, first we need to get the N8 and hosting. So we are going to purchase N8 and from Webspace Kit where we get unlimited workflow executions and unlimited active workflows. Since N8 is open source, you get so much more benefits when you host it on your own on a platform like Webspace Kit. So to host N8 on Webspace Kit, just click the link in the description and it'll take you to this page. Scroll down and click choose plan. Here choose how long you want the hosting for. Then fill in these details. Here enter your payment details and click checkout. Now click here and you can see that we have successfully got the N8N hosting. So once you've got the hosting, next we need to set up the N8N automation. To do that, just scroll down, click on go to setup, fill in these details, click next and it will take you to this page. Now this is the place where we are going to create the workflow. You can create a workflow from scratch but it takes a lot of time. So to make things easier, we've already created a workflow template and it is available on Webspace Kit for free. Okay, now our friend Mark will explain the process of setting up this agent. Hi guys, this is Mark. So now I will show you how to get the template. To get the template, go back to Webspace Kit, scroll down. Here you'll find different workflow templates for various AI agents. Since we are creating a video analyze AI agent, let's select that and click download. Once downloaded, open your N8N workflow canvas and import the template file. Select the downloaded file and click open. Great, the template is now imported. Step one, set up the upload file node. To get this working, we need Google AI credentials. So let's get those. Open a new tab and search for Google AI developer. Click on the first result. Now select explore models. Then click get API key and hit create API key. Once your API key is generated, copy it. Now switch back to N8N, open the upload file node, click create new credentials. For the name, type key, paste the API key into the value field. Click save. Done. That node is now connected. Step two, set up, get analysis node. Next, open the get analysis node. Make sure your Google AI credentials are applied here too. Now repeat the same for the YouTube video node. Just open it and the connection should happen automatically. Step three, set up Google Docs integration. We'll now set up the HTTP request node that creates your AI report inside Google Docs. Open HTTP request node. Here's how to get the required credentials. Open a new tab and search for Google Developer Console. Click the first link and hit create a project. Name your project and click create. Now, select the project you just created. From the left side menu, go to APIs and Services, Library. Search for Google Drive API and click Enable. Then search for Google Docs API and enable that too. Now go to OAuth Consent screen and click Get Started. Name your app. Choose a support email. Select External, then Proceed. Enter contact details. Agree and continue. Done? Great! Now, click Create OAuth Client. Choose Web Application. Now, go back to N8N and copy the redirect URL. Paste it into the redirect field in the console. 
click Create. You'll now see the client ID and client secret. Copy both and head back to N8N. Paste the client ID and client secret into the respective fields and save. Now, go back to the developer console. Go to Audience. Click Publish App. Then hit Confirm. You're all set. And back in N8N, click Sign in with Google. Choose your Gmail. Click Advanced. Then allow all permissions and hit continue. Your Google account is now connected to the workflow. Before testing, just ensure the second HTTP request node also has the Google credentials applied. Then save your workflow. Let's test the workflow. Option one. Upload a video file. Click Submit after uploading. The workflow will analyze the video. It will create a Google Doc with your video report. Open the document, and there it is. A detailed AI analysis of your video. Option two, use a YouTube video link. Click Execute Workflow. Paste your YouTube video URL. Hit Submit. The analysis starts, and within moments, you get your video insights in a Google Doc. And that's it. That's how the Video Analysis AI Agent works. So that's it, guys. Your N8 and automation is ready. And if you found this helpful, give it a like and subscribe to Website Learners for more quick tutorials. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.